I've got a million ideas. I mean, I've got an entire design for an electric supersonic vertical takeoff. I have endless ideas. Today, I even have a complete design for an electric supersonic vertical takeoff jet. That dream has finally crossed the line from imagination into real life. The $78,910 Tesla Super Electric plane is finally here. And behind closed doors, Tesla engineers have been quietly working on a new master plan. Torque Element is ready to blow your mind with Tesla's shocking production plan for the year 2026 that will change everything. Whether you live in New York, Los Angeles, London, or Sydney, the question is no longer if Tesla will fly, but how soon you and your family will be stepping aboard. So buckle in, subscribe now, and turn on the bell because you are becoming one of our next 2000 insiders who get access to every breakthrough from the front row. Tesla's future rests on how it uses its gigafactories. These giant plants built Tesla's empire on the ground. But can they also conquer the skies? The answer comes in the second quarter of 2026 when production of the Tesla Super Electric plane officially begins. Three leaders will take the charge, Gigafactory Texas in Austin, Gigafactory Shanghai in China, and Gigafactory Berlin Brandenburg in Germany. A fourth giant, Gigafactory Mexico in Monterey, joins in the first quarter of 2027. Texas already built over 410,000 vehicles in one quarter of 2025, proving it can handle massive output. Shanghai connects Tesla directly to Asia Pacific. Berlin serves Europe and the United Kingdom. Mexico expands into North and Latin America. Together, they form the perfect triangle of aviation production. By 2026, three factories will dedicate 20% of their floor space only for plane building. That means turning automotive lines into aerospace lines with composite airframe assembly and aluminum air battery production modules. Each factory costs about $500 million to upgrade, making a $1.5 billion investment. But Tesla has done this before. The Shanghai plant was built in only 10 months in 2019. Add the $5 billion committed to Mexico, and it is clear Tesla is not just dreaming, it is executing. Tesla's vertical integration system, which already lets them build 80% of car parts in-house, is now moving into aviation. This is how they keep costs lean while aiming for mass production. Gigafactory Texas will be the heart, producing 5,000 planes a year by 2028, half of Tesla's total. Shanghai will make 3,000 planes yearly for Asia, Berlin 2,000 for Europe, and Mexico 2,000 more starting in 2027. Altogether, that is 10,000 planes each year by 2028 and 20,000 by 2030. For perspective, the global light aircraft market is about 200,000 units yearly. Tesla aims for a 5% share in less than four years. With the electric vertical takeoff and landing market projected to reach $9 trillion by 2050, the numbers add up. And Tesla's edge is automation. 80% of a Model Y is already built by robots cutting labor costs by 30% compared to old aerospace giants. Add SpaceX's knowledge in composites and flight certifications, and Tesla's production costs could fall 20% below the industry. Each gigafactory will also make 10 gigawatt hours of aluminum air batteries yearly, enough for 5,000 to 10,000 planes. This mirrors how Tesla scaled from 936,000 cars in 2021 to 1.79 million in 2024. So let me ask you, do you believe Texas will really make 5,000 planes a year by 2028? Drop the word 5,000 in the comments if you are strapped in for this journey. Now, how will Tesla deliver these planes to customers? Tesla already runs more than 200 distribution centers for cars, energy, and charging products. That same network will handle aviation, letting Tesla scale without building from scratch. If Tesla delivered 1.79 million cars in 2024, with over 422,000 in just one quarter of 2023, handling a few thousand planes will be easy. But here is where Tesla really changes things. By 2028, the company will set up 100 urban vertiports worldwide, 50 in the United States, 30 in Europe, 15 in Asia, and 5 more across the United Kingdom and Australia. These are not just landing spots. They are charging stations, maintenance hubs, and delivery points inside cities where people live. You won't need to drive hours to an airport. 
your Tesla super electric plane could arrive at the nearest vertiport in Los Angeles, New York, or Las Vegas. Delivery times prove the system works. In the United States, an order in the third quarter of 2026 could be delivered in the fourth quarter, just three months later. In the United Kingdom, three and a half months. In Europe, four months. In Asia, even with demand, Tesla guarantees five months thanks to Shanghai's 3,000 planes per year. Imagine someone in Tokyo ordering in mid-2026 and getting their plane by early 2027. This is the same playbook that scaled the Model Y to 1,200,000 units per year in four years. Backing this are Tesla's $10 billion in reserves and a $13 billion yearly research budget shared with SpaceX. Starlink 7000 satellites already enable real-time tracking of every delivery plane. Demand is also strong. The electric vertical takeoff market is growing at 30% annually from 2025 to 2030. In 2023, 70% of travelers said they preferred sustainable options. Tesla is not chasing a dream. It is simply giving the world what it wants. If Tesla is promising United States deliveries in 2026, are you ready to park one in your garage? Comment $78,910 if you are ready. The biggest question, how did Tesla solve the battery problem? Heavy batteries held electric planes back for decades. Tesla's answer is the aluminum air battery, giving 520 watt-hours per kilogram, 38% more than lithium-ions 320. This cuts weight by 3,300 pounds for small aircraft, finally making electric planes practical. Aluminum air batteries use oxygen from the air as the cathode, lowering weight while keeping high density. Tesla's tests already reached 1,000 watt-hours per kilogram, with 520 certified for aviation. Yes, jet fuel has 12,000 watt-hours per kilogram, but electric motors are three times more efficient. That makes Tesla's battery enough for a 720-mile range, covering most United States domestic routes with zero emissions at far lower cost. Safety comes first. Aluminum air batteries are non-flammable, unlike lithium-ion, and meet FAA and ASA rules. Tesla's battery management system extends life to 3,000 cycles, equal to 30 years of service at 100 flights per year. This is strong, reliable, and built to last. Here, SpaceX brings synergy. Carbon composites from Starship projects cut airframe weight by 15%. AI navigation systems boost Tesla's self-flying controls, more precise than human pilots. Together, they are building aviation tech decades ahead of rivals. This breakthrough removes the biggest barrier to electric flight, making ranges of up to 1,800 miles possible. Tesla now leads aviation batteries with the option to license to others. Can you imagine never paying for jet fuel again? Comment Tesla battery if you believe this will change the future of flying. But a plane is nothing without infrastructure. Tesla is investing $2 billion into a global network of charging and maintenance hubs. By 2028, there will be 200 megawatt charging stations, 100 in America, 50 in Europe, 40 in Asia, and 10 in the United Kingdom and Australia. These chargers can give 80% in just 30 to 45 minutes, using upgraded technology from Tesla Semi's 1 megawatt system. Tesla is putting in $1.5 billion from cash reserves and $500 million in partnerships. 50 maintenance hubs will also launch by 2028 near Gigafactories and Vertiports. Tesla is spending $500 million on AI diagnostics to cut servicing costs by 20%. The Texas hub alone can handle 2,000 planes a year with a 24-hour turnaround. SpaceX Synergy adds more power. Starlink satellites will give real-time updates to every plane, reaching 99.9% .9 uptime. Reusable rocket maintenance lessons will keep Tesla planes cheap and fast to repair. This system ends range anxiety forever. Chargers within 100 miles of 90% of cities mean you are never stranded. Costs drop by 80% compared to regular jets, making flying cheaper than driving while cutting emissions. Comment Tesla infrastructure if you want to see aviation rebuilt. The numbers are clear. 10,000 planes by 2028. 20,000 by 2030, $10 billion in reserves. SpaceX Technology. 
Tesla is building not only planes but an entire ecosystem of airports, chargers, and maintenance. And they are hiding one more secret. The real game changer is not just the plane. It is Tesla's plan to make flying available for everyday families, not just the wealthy. That is coming in Torque Elements' next exclusive breakdown. The sky is not the limit anymore. It is Tesla's playground and we are just getting started. What do you think was the most mind-blowing part of Tesla's strategy? Drop your thoughts below and let us keep this conversation flying high.